previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit! Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! You could have saved him! How could you just leave him? Others will find us? Who knows? Why'd you leave my uncle? Back at the stream. Why'd you follow me? Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. What do we do now? I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. Do you think they'll break through that window? Guess I'll just stand here, talking to myself. Still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. But that rig ain't fit to piss in. Nick, you wanna give me some help here? Are you listening to me? Fine, just sit there. All this food is rotten. I said this food is rotten.
What is that stuff? Let me see. Whiskey. Now what? Oh, fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. What's your problem? I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. Everyone I grew up with, it all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. We're all so fucked. This whole world is fucked. We'll make it. Bullshit. I mean, what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Hey, kid. Have a drink with me. It's gonna be your first. And your last. <laughs> to Peter Joseph Randall, the nicest mean old bastard I ever knew. <laughs> Listen, they're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What, what are you gonna do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. They're good people. Better than me. We can make it. We have to try. I don't have to do anything. Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're family. Nick, I need your help. Please. You're right. Yeah. <sighs> now look, if we get separated, the cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. You ready? <clears throat> Fuck it.
you, motherfucker. Oh, shit. Hey, over here. Come on, you fucks. Look at me. Get the fuck out of here. I said get the fuck out of here. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! He got killed. I was with Nick, but... My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. Say cheese! I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Please? Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? They're just fishing. I know that's not true. <sighs> Sorry, I, I, I just need to... You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? Nobody tells me anything. Okay, but it's not a toy. I know. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. I thought it'd be heavier. Okay, what do I do? The most important thing is, always aim for the head. Okay. Unless it's a person trying to hurt you, then what do I do? Just keep shooting. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry sory Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back!
That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. What? Why can't he see you? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Shh. Hello? Okay, how are you? Well, I'm doing just fine, thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Clementine. Clementine? Well, you look just like a Clementine. You mind if I come in, Clementine? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. Just me and, and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and... I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Now, I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Hell, I just got here and I already don't want to leave. Just passing through. Going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. Who have you met going north? Oh, hell, a lot of folks. Anyone named Krista? No, not that I can recall. She a friend of yours? Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch, but a smart man. I miss him. What's his name? Carlos. Well, well, White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here.
I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Never seen her before. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Well, wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. We don't know anything yet. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I don't remember. You don't remember? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? How old was he? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know. Kind of deep and scratchy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not going to hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Uh, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not going to do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving out. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Where are we going? Anywhere but here. Into the mountains, maybe. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Now, you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. I still don't like what you did. 
sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. But I know you were in a tough spot. I'll try to cut you some slack. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. Nick! Get the door. Jesus. Hey, man. You got any aspirin? Nick, you asshole. Pete's dead. I know, man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. Clem, uh, I just wanted to say, thanks for not giving up on me. Don't worry about it. I won't forget it. What happened back there in that cellar? Did he do something stupid? Nick saved my life. Really? Yeah, sort of. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. We may not be perfect, but we look out for each other. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Here, eat this back. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. 
We need to keep your strength up, baby. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. <clears throat> nice work, kid. <clears throat> Ow. Help! I'm okay! 
okay. I just I'm stuck. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll, we'll figure something out. Behind you! Oh, shit. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. I mean, you really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. You know, on second thought, maybe I should do the talking. Is he with Carver? It's hard to see. I don't think so. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. Wanna help me out here? I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything. But you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. I'm not an asshole. Well, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. You all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, nah, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Don't shoot! Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? We thought you were in trouble. You were waving your arms. Why did you shoot? He pointed a gun at me. 
Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Everybody calm down. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? Because you're an asshole? I don't know. It happened so fast. But you were right there. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't... Don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. You could use a little downsizing. You're one to talk. Sure. Thanks, Clem. Rebecca, are you okay? I'm all right. I just need a little rest. And some food. Alvin. Hey, Clem, you check out that station yet? Not yet. Thanks a lot for backing me up there. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. I found it back at the cabin. Let me grab it. What? Really? Thank you. <sighs> this means... Thank you, Clem. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. It's dead. I guess he slept here. The man said he had lots of food. There's gotta be something left. <clears throat> I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Feels pretty good.
Man, and I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever known anyone to do a thing like that? Actually, yeah. What happened? A woman in our group. Her dad died, and then she just shot this other woman. Damn. What'd you do? My friend forgave her. Huh. And then she stole our car and left us. Huh. That's funny. She looks just like you. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Bam! Nailed down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. <gasps> oh, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down. Just for a second, okay? Keep your voice down. But you just yelled at me. Shut up! Made it! <laughs> you see anything? I can see the bridge. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke.
Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Penny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? Talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. 